crowd start to find their voice as Victor looked to mount another attack. Here is Betty Goat again. She's standing out early and a header flash is just wide for Melbourne Victory. Terrific chance. A really, really good chance for Lowe to add to her mounting goal tally. Taylor. Given away by Kate Taylor. And Aquino goes to deck under challenge as uh, she and McMeekin ran into the penalty area together. In fact, it's won it. Or crossed in again, half away. Still there for Melbourne Victory and into the bread basket of Riley Foster. That was from Aquino that time. So the chances are mounting, even though Victory are playing against this breeze. Pretty heavy, heavily populated six-yard area for Go to aim the ball towards, which she does. A little flick into the back post, and they're ahead, ah, Melbourne Victory. Set piece taken brilliantly by Beattie Goad. They're headed towards the far post, defeated Foster, and into the far corner it went, and Victory lead just going to pick up who got the final touch. Once again, it's a six-yard box, which is very clogged. Breslin. Plenty of air on that one towards the back. Headed back across goal by Speckmeyer. And in she goes. And an equaliser has arrived in the form of Kate Taylor. Well, everybody seemed to stop. I think they thought it had gone behind Melbourne victory. And they're protesting about that. Speckmeyer headed it back across goal. And from just about on the goal line, Kate Taylor could not miss. They are adamant this has gone behind Melbourne victory. There's Speckmeyer. Well, it didn't look like it. And Kate Taylor, her third A-League women's goal. Wellington starting to take a bit of advantage of the wind at their backs here. Here's Kelly Brown. She might not have a shot. And does! Oh, and gets the frame of the goal and then headed in by Emma Main. And Wellington from 1-0 down at 2-1 ahead. Emma Main has scored from close range, but a thunderbolt from Kelly Brown in the build-up. All action here in Porirua. Davidson into Maine, return it to space. Brown's off on a run if Maine can find her. Instead, she goes herself and has the ball taken away from her. Still there for Wellington. Nash gets it away, though. Another one into the penalty area for Foster to deal with, and she hasn't dealt with it. Aquino's gone round her and finds the back of the net. Excellent finish from Korea Okino, she scores in back-to-back -back matches for Melbourne Victory, nicking it past Riley Foster, and then from a fairly challenging angle, finding a finish into the far corner, and all of a sudden we're back to 2-2 in Porirua. That's not an easy finish there as well. You know, she still had to do some work once she'd taken it around Foster. It's a great ball in from KK, so inviting. Melbourne Victory have pushed their defensive lineup considerably. Expecting the win to play a part. Now, Macy Fraser's had a shot here. Well, I guess you can't blame her. She <laughs> scored a specky down there, albeit from slightly closer to the goal. But, yeah, maybe the wind encouraged Macy Fraser to try a speculator from about 40 yards. Yeah, that's a play that's not short of confidence and things I love to see. Breslin can't keep hold of it, though. It's Morrison. Murphy. Out wide, it's a good ball to Rankin. And across the six-yard area. Just needed a touch. Excellent, excellent piece of play from Rankin. Rating from left back. And no final touch applied. Yeah, that's great play from Victory to get the ball out there. Longo. Now Main. Davidson is outside. Main cuts inside. Main shoots. Lydia Williams always looked comfortable, really, with it and pouches it safely enough. That could be the last action of this first half in Potty to it. Davidson unable to clear. It's there for Rankin. Now the shot from a long way out from Murphy looking to test the 
assistance of the breeze behind her there. So corners were productive for both sides in the first half. What about the second? Goad drifts it into a dangerous area. Good header away by Barry. Shot missed by Lowe. And then Wellington just about clear their lines. Goad helps it back in. Foster untroubled. As they try and roar home their home side. Wynett and McMeekin for the umpteenth time. Wynett with the shot, Foster goes to deck and claims it well. Nice pass from Fraser to Wynnum. Moving to space from her and a ball into the pass of Speckmeyer. Maliana Speckmeyer is one on one and can't find the target. Terrific ball into her path and Mariana Speckmeyer bearing down on goal but couldn't find the finish.